all right i love bugs take your love vitamin so let's do something different confirmation from a man those of you all doing with me let's see how he feels about you let's get some confirmation how you feel like this man feels about you let's confirm his feelings ow so this is meant to give you some sort of clarity um, this is a man that does want to take some sort of lead in your life. This is a person that feels very joyful. They, ve they feel very stable, very solid. For this energy right here with these with these three cards, this man right here is a man that feels very balanced. You make him have a sense of peace, a sense of purpose. You help him balance out his feminine and masculine energy. Um, this is a man that you make feel exceptionally comfortable. So let's see if that energy continues to flow. Um, let's see. What does the collective need to know about the confirmation of those that's on the man, his feelings? How does he feel? Confirm the feelings. How does this man feel? Ooh, take the lead. So there is a man that wants to take the lead in um in your life. He wants you to trust him. And listen, so there's a man that wants someone to listen to him. He has something to say. He wants to get something off his chest. Um, this could be someone that you're in a relationship with. This could be someone that you know you um, haven't heard from. It could be new. It could be old. But this is a man that's very balanced out now. This is a person that understands life. They've changed. It's 14 going down to a 5. This is a man that wants to have some sort of successful outcome between the two of you all. And there is something this man wants to give you. All right, let's take a look. Let's take a look. All right, let's see. This man is this is a man that does watch you. So some of you all could be someone who uh, admires you secretly. Uh, it could be someone that you know just takes note of your life. It could be someone that you're dating. All right, let's see. What's his lead? How does he feel about the collection? The star card and the high priestess. So this is a person that has secret feelings. This, this, now, some of you all, this is a person that secretly admires you. Others of you all, this is someone here who does not want you to know, okay, I, I like you. You know, I'm feeling you. Uh, they just, This man does have a plan. He does have intentions. Uh, there could be a there could be an energy of him being like nervous to let you know how he feels. The star card here also. This is a person that for some of you all they want to secretly heal something. So some of you all have an old energy that just lingers around you. That just is what it is. And that person they have not gotten over you. Have not let um let you go. They have not released their feelings. Cannot release their feelings or just simply don't want to. All right. What's the listen? What's the listen? This, per this man wants you to listen to him about these feelings, honey. What do they need to know about this man? The seven of cups. So some of you all can have some things that needs to be sorted out. Now, some of you all, there's been like a third party situation. Uh, this could be someone that has an addictive um, behavior or some sort of addiction in all these cups here. This could be drinking. It could be drugs. It could be partying. It could be a non-committal um, non component. This is a person that's saying, look, let's, I want to just talk about this. Let's address this. So some of you all have a man that wants to address an issue. And all he's saying is, will you listen to me? Will you open up your ears and listen? Not just hear me. Let's sort some things out. Uh, now, so, now, let me say this. <clears throat> This could be someone who's trying to tie you all into an unconventional, like third party, open relationship, something like that. Um, but he want, he he wants, this seems like a person that wants to be honest about what he really wants, whether it's an open relationship, you know, if y'all are in this third party or, or something like that, or this, this particular addiction. The page of wands, he feels like his intentions are good and he feels like his intentions are warranted. Like, you know, we need to have this discussion. We need to have a conversation about you and me and everything that goes on or potentially could go on. This is a man that has cried over someone here with the three of swords. This is a man that's heartbroken. Uh, what's the uh, what's the star card? Ooh. Oh heck yeah, the ace of wands. So this is a man that has feelings like yeah, I really I really could see myself really having something with this person. I feel like it could go far. This is an emperor here. This is a person right here that could want to let a guard down or just let you in. This could be a um, emperor, a man that wants to open up. Uh, there is an energy, let's say, that this is an emperor that wants to open up and reconcile or, you know, let's go out, let's meet up. 
uh, let's catch up, let's talk, something like that. This person right here wants to show you that they're open now. They're not as closed off as they used to be. They probably didn't want to discuss things before, but I hear discussion. They want to have a discussion, but their intentions really are good, really are I keep hearing the word longevity as well. Someone sees you as a person they can have longevity with. What's the high priestess here, Holy Spirit? The Knight of Swords. Person about to bust the move. What's the high priestess here, Holy Spirit? Oh, God. If this man hurts you, he feels bad about that. This is also a man that's going through some things, y'all. Mm-hmm. He's at his breaking point. He's breaking down. He's been broken down. He wants to share his secrets with you. These are secret feelings, secret emotions, his secret. If, if it's a secret life and or lifestyle, this is a person that wants to open up. And for some of you all here, there's a person that wants to have a conversation with you, just point blank, period, about you and them and potentially somebody else because two people are in this card. Somebody could have chose um, love, excuse me, like money, over love because green is the money, red is the love. So they made it. They made this is this is like an unwise choice. And when they made this unhealthy choice, unhealthy decision, they they tapped into a karmic cycle. And this karmic cycle was a spe some specific lessons he had to learn about love and money and things of that nature and choices. This is a man that is a uh, burden. He he likely has obstacles. With the obstacles being this high up, there are some things for some of these men that y'all getting this conference about there's a lot going on there's a lot that stood in his way between him getting towards you so that there's some things there's a lot that has to be you know discussed for some of you all but he's going through a tower a secret tower yeah the death card something that's ended in his life is inevitable and this is this ending right here is meant to make him become more of a man. This is likely an ending with a relationship with someone else. If this is you, he wants to talk about do you think we should end it? Do you think it's do you think it's worth it? Yeah. This could be a legal component here with the justice card, the two of wands. This person has a plan. So those of you all that are dealing with these men that have plans and don't include you, this is a man that wants to include you in the plan or, you know, discuss some things and say, you know, can we come up with a plan? The will of fortune here, those that getting this, getting this confirmation, this particular man has good intentions. Uh, this is a person that may feel like I got to be honest and I have to have integrity. This is a person that did show you some sort of unrequited love. They could, this person could have not had feelings for you before, and now he does. Anything else to pull this out about this man? Attraction. He's very attracted to you. Um, it's safe for you to love this person. Children. This is a man with children for some of you all. Um, it is safe for you to love. So this is confirmation that a man wants to have a conversation. He wants to let you know it's safe for you to love him. Um, and he wants to open up about some things. There is some fear of surrounding this situation with him. He could be a man that, you know, fear has really crippled him. That could be the obstacle that was in his life, being honest. Some inner child issues. Somebody here, a man got a lot to say. But I'm hearing all kind of ish back here. These videos ain't gonna be long, honey. This is a man of much regrets, honey. Ugh. Creativity is inverted. Whatever he has tried to do before, it has not worked. This is a man that you know could have tried to get you to listen to him before or not. You know, you know how people say they bend the truth or they tell a little white lie. This is a man that's forced to have integrity, um, to have some sort of character and be honest. Uh, I hear it's the noble. Th it's a noble thing to do. This is a man that's going to divulge his secrets to you and ask you to forgive him. This is a man full of regrets, though. This person really stressed, and this this is a man that has a lot of remorse for whatever reason. It's unavoidable. You have Cancer, Aries, Cancer, Aries, and Scorpio. Peace and blessings, great day. I hope this helps. Namaste.